Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Now there won't be a new tutorial coming out this week but I just wanted to give you a quick update of what's been going on and assure you that I have in fact not died just yet. The first thing I want to share is that I've now got my Blender beginner course available on Skillshare. Now it is available on my website but I've also now uploaded it and made it available on Skillshare and you can watch it for free on Skillshare with a free one month trial. I'm going to drop you the link to that down in the video description. Now I will get a bit of a kickback if you stay on past the first month trial but for for the first 30 days you can just watch whatever you want and you don't have to pay a thing so i now have three courses on skillshare my after effects course my premiere pro course and my blender course i'm going to link you everything down below but there's a ton of other great classes out on skillshare that are worth checking out so go jump in and check that out if that's something you're into and of course all of the courses are also available on my website but if you've got a skillshare subscription already you may as well check them out on there costs you absolutely nothing extra Another thing I'm currently working on is I'm currently reviewing some microphones for Rode. They sent me the Rode Wireless Me and the Rode Wireless Go 2. So I've got those microphones here. I've already released a review on the Rode Wireless Me, which I actually really like. They're super easy to use. The sound quality is amazing. The range is great. Over 100 meters, I walked really far away in the park. It sounded great. The only thing I don't quite like about them is the size, that they are quite noticeable. It's compared to, you know, like a small little wired a lapel microphone but other than that they're really fantastic and i'm currently finalizing my review for the rode wireless go 2 which are a little bit more professional have a few more safety and backup features than the rode wireless me so if you need things like you know onboard recording and safety channels and a few other things that make you feel a little bit more safe in recording with a wireless lapel microphone the go 2 is probably the way to go but i'll release a full video for that coming up pretty soon as well so just keep an eye out and again i'll link you the review for the rode wireless me down below as well so go and check that out if you're keen the next thing I want to talk about is that I'm currently working on the second part of my tutorial series on how to create cinematic movies in Unreal Engine 5. Now, I have been using Unreal Engine 5 to create short movie sequences and visual effects for both my collaborations with Action VFX as well as my more recent one with Razer and NVIDIA Studio, which I had a lot of fun with. So I've really been enjoying Unreal Engine to create cinematic movie sequences and set up, you know, cameras and like environments and just kind of move around. It's pretty fun. It's really cool. So I'm currently working on a tutorial series that will show you how to create your own cinematic movies in Unreal Engine. The first part is already available and it covers all of the basics of how to get started with Unreal Engine 5. I'm currently working on part two, which shows you how to work with level sequences, which are actual cutscenes where you can then animate your cameras and your objects and, you know, set all of your shots up just the way you want to. And then there'll be some follow-up parts for how to export that into a movie file and, you know, maybe some free assets and how to set up your scene and make things a little bit more cinematic. Again, if that is something you're into, I'm going to drop you the links to all of the playlists and videos down in the video description. So again, go and check that out. And that's all I have for you today. Just a quick update and a flood of links for you to check out again if you're interested. As always, any comments, questions, suggestions, feedback, just leave them down below the video. And for that, thank you very much for watching and until next time, I will see you later.